Hey, what's up guys? Today is September the 11th. We are out here in Buckhead, Atlanta. Uh, this is a very uh, special uh, jobs that we're doing today. And actually, Mr. Dave, uh, my ride along, stayed for a third day to learn about screen and recoding engineer floors. So anyway, guys, um, this um, company, they uh, took over these condominiums. It's 186 units. They all have engineered floors. And they were referred to me from a builder that I helped save some floors so they didn't have to replace them. And that builder came from another builder that I helped save some floors so they didn't have to replace them. all engineer floors. And that builder was referred to me by Shaw um, because some people who work at Shaw know me. So anyway, guys, I came out here um, yesterday and just to show you, man, how good things happen. So the client said, Courtney, um, we want you to do all the units, but we have a few units we need done like ASAP because we have people moving in. So I came out here yesterday and I actually had a job today, but he called yesterday and had to postpone because his contractors are not done. So we came out here, me and Mr. Dave, she showed us the two units. I gave him a price for both units. Uh, this one right here, which I'm about to show you guys, has some very deep scratches. And again, these type of floors cannot be um, sanded and they cannot find these boards anymore. So we're gonna do a deep scratch repair. Then we're gonna screen the floor and all their units, they want UV cure. So uh, let me show you what we're gonna be doing today. Uh, on the first unit. All right, so this is the first unit right here. So I've already got my heat gun. So you see these deep scratches right here, guys? That's definitely um, intentional. Maybe some, it was definitely some furniture and it just scratched the wood. So what we're gonna do first, I'm gonna show Mr. Dave how to do a uh, scratch repair. And then we're gonna screen all the floors down. And guys, these units are renting for $2,000 a month. So we got this, this, and um, there's my UV machine, and uh, the rag coat is outside. And this is what, this is just a one bedroom, and this is written for two grand a month. Uh, and then we have another one we're gonna be doing downstairs after we're done here. So just kinda show you guys what we got going. So we're gonna go ahead and start repairing this scratch first. Then we're gonna screen the floor down, vacuum, clean it, and then get the rag coat down. And while the rag coat is drying, we're gonna go downstairs and fix that floor, which also needs some color correction, and then screen and recoat with UV cure. All right, guys, I'm so grateful for this opportunity, and thank you, Dave, for staying a third day, and um, we're about to get to work. All right, All right guys, so you can see what we're doing. We're using different waxes. This is a technique, and this, of course, is a hands and knees job. Um, this little kit I bought, I actually own about three of them. These kits are about five, six hundred bucks. So again, if you're serious about you know your craft and what you do, you want to invest in you know good equipment. Um, so just to show you, you see that line, you see that right there where we're fixing. So we're using a little bit of um, these are not these are our stain, but these are more like grain pins, not actual stain markers. And then we got our waxes, and you can just see how much better that's coming out. And then once we smooth that down and then what I do I take a little plastic not um, not a metal now don't use a metal razor you can get these little plastic razors from Amazon and um, the access of your wax just kind of go and you can see how I'm just shaving so I'm definitely giving you guys some tips uh, some of you guys that follow me that say oh Courtney you never share um, you know again guys I do say this numerous times my YouTube channel is not a uh, educational channel but I don't mind sharing tips but for the main reason I have clients who would try to buy some of this stuff and they would end up wasting their money um, or they would ruin the floor so that's why I really don't share a lot on my channel and I do it in my you know my groups because of that reason um, homeowners are always trying to find ways to do certain things and again just because you can buy it um, doesn't mean you can do it and I've seen a lot of people mess up a lot of floors so me and I'm gonna let Mr. Dave um, and then also too I kind of get some unique colors and I kind of blend them so I got four colors that I'm kind of uh, using to um, add the uh, uh, 
the uh, hard wax back to the uh, scratch and then we're going to screen and recoat and then um uh, yeah screen recoat and then uv cure all right guys stay tuned Characteristics will be all going, mm -hmm. uh, but with these floors, you can't sand them, and this is the only, not the only option, but another option besides replacing the floor. So, all right, so guys, we they had the entire investment team in here uh, watching the after results, and guys, look from a distance, you cannot even tell, even when I get up close. Look at that, look at that repair, that is amazing. And again, this floor could not be sanded. And for them to replace these boards, it would have, not to say it could not be done, but with a lot of my installers that I know, the reason why they don't like to replace engineered floors because they're glued down. So by the time you start taking that board out, 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 then some of the other boards that are connected to will start breaking out and they say sometimes it's not worth it. But that guy, that, that, that is a million dollar uh, result. So what we're gonna do now, I'm gonna let Mr. Dave uh, go ahead and screen this floor down. We're gonna screen down the entire floor. Um, also too, we see a little areas here. They actually did a little blending right there to make that look better. And um, we're gonna go ahead and start screening. And after that, we're gonna go with the Pro Coat Red Coat. And yeah, and then we'll see you guys downstairs. All right, stay tuned. Go ahead, Mr. Dave. Vacuum, oh my god, look at that. <laughs> so we vacuum, clean and tacked, and now, um, yo, we are clean and tacking now. And we just got a little few areas we want to do some color correction, and uh, we're going to get the rag coat down. And then what I'm doing now is transporting some of the equipment from upstairs to downstairs uh, to the other unit. And uh, yeah, guys, so uh, clean and tacking right now, and uh, this floor is looking amazing. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, guys, we got the rag coat going down. This is the rag coat, the only finish that can be UV cured. And um, what they was telling me is um, as we do all the units, they want to UV cure all of them. So not only do they have the best finish, because, again, these are, you know, rent, they're renting these out. Um, so they want to have some good durable finish on them. And... Um, they want these to be ready. So let's say if they have someone like the one that we're doing downstairs, today is Thursday. They have someone moving in that place tomorrow, all right? So with the UV cure, they can um, get on it immediately after we run the UV machine across. So uh, what Mr. David is doing now is uh, applying his finish. And, um, and uh, yeah, guys, so once we're done rolling here, we're going to go downstairs and start that one and uh, grab a bite to eat. And of course, in Buckhead, um, you can't go wrong. All right, guys. Stay All right, guys. Tuned. We just got to the second unit, so we got the uh, red coat down at uh, the first unit, um, which is on the fifth floor. This is on the main floor. Uh, so here, we got a little water damage, but we can add some color back. 
um, here. So on this job, these are not deep scratches. So instead of the wax kit, we're gonna use stain um, and also stain marker. So you can see a lot of uh, the missing veneer chipping off. All right, all through here. All right, and again, this is a situation where most uh, contractors will walk in and say, replace the floor. Uh, so we're gonna save the floor. All right, guys. All right, guys, I just booked the uh, consultation. A lady uh, said she did a lot of research in Alpharetta uh, to restore her floors, and uh, she was very impressed with my website. And also, she said, I love your uh, video testimonial, so I'm gonna go uh, give her a uh, consultation uh, Monday morning cause, uh, before I go do a screen of recoat in the uh, St. Marlowe's Country Club. So, uh, guys, right now, all right, so uh, we are, Mr. David is screening the floors down, as you can see. So again, a nice screen on these floors. Perfect. And then I'm just gonna push this vacuum up. Whoever got this, uh, actually someone's moving in here tomorrow. This is the one that a, uh, a tenant is moving in tomorrow. And they got a pretty nice view. They got the pool view. <laughs> it's almost like they got the pool to themselves. Yep. All right, guys. All right, guys. They Ooh. are doing our color correction on this floor. So again, this is not the hard wax. This is more using stain, um, stain markers, um, and you know, things like that. So that's what we're doing on this floor. All right. All right. All right, hey. guys, stay tuned. I want you to see the color correction before we put the finish down. Perfect. All right. All right, guys, so this is Mrs. Cash. I'm not gonna put it on camera. Maybe she don't wanna be up, but look at the color correction now, guys. Yeah. So much better. Yes, ma'am. So much better. So we're gonna go ahead and get the coating down. Okay. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna uh, go check out the unit upstairs. Mm -hmm. um, while he's uh, rolling, I'm gonna look at the time. Uh, I might UV cure it now, if not, I gotta go do a consultation okay. in, uh, by the airport, and then I'm gonna come back and UV cure both of them. Oh, okay. Um, okay? Yeah. But what time do you usually leave? Six. Okay, so uh, what I'll do, I'll just probably just uh, send you an invoice. Um, and okay. Then, yep, and, and then I just, pay it. Yeah, yeah. I, got, I got my boss's credit card. So okay, perfect. So we're good. Perfect. This is, great. this is great. Thank you. This is good news. Thank you. And then we'll get together too and try to work out like some, like, Hard pricing, yes. So that we'll know going forward what we're going to be. That's doing. what I'm going to do because David's going to actually help me. No matter which unit it is, it'll just be a set price. Right. And so let's say if you got five a month or ten a month, mm -hmm. you'll know how much you'd be paying every time. You know, a bunch of them. Yep. yep. That's what we're going to need. Yes. Awesome. Thank you. Thank guys. you so much. All right, guys, that was Mrs. Cash. Um, again, she was the um, referral that was referred to me from a builder, and you can see the floors look amazing with the color correction. So what I'm gonna do is let um, David roll the uh, rat coat, and I'm gonna drop David off. He actually got a room close here in Buckhead. I'm gonna drop him off because he's gonna go ahead and hit the road and head back to um, North Carolina. Uh, to get back to his business and um and then um like i said either i'll just uv cure the one upstairs while i'm up there or if not i'll just come back and just re uv cure both of them because it won't take long to re uh, uv cure each one, maybe 15 20 minutes each one all right guys well again that is some great color correction as you can see the before and after even over here with this water damage and uh yeah you just heard her ask me about uh coming up with a set price um, to do uh, the, the rest of the units. All right, guys. All right, guys. Stay tuned. I went upstairs to check the unit upstairs. Still a little tacky. So what I'm going to go do is uh, grab. I was going to go do my consultation, but I told them I won't get back here till about 6:30, and he told me um, they'll be gone, and I won't have access to get back in the units. So luckily, my client told me I can come Saturday morning before I go do my job in Midtown um, between 9 and 10. And uh, so yeah, so what I'm going to do is um, that is looking really good, and I'm going to uh, drop again Dave off at his uh, van, and then I'm going to go get something to eat, and uh, and then come back and UBQ these floors and uh, take it from there. All right, guys. all right, guys. I am UB curing 
the first unit where we did the scratch repair. Miss Cash is actually on her way up now. I went and dropped David off and then I went and had me a little lunch. <clears throat> that looks amazing. So Miss Cash is gonna come upstairs so she can see the UV. Cause what's gonna happen guys, every time I come out here, I'm just gonna give them a set price for each unit. And uh, like she said, she'll have like five to 10 a month and every unit will get UV cured. That scratch came out so good. Yes, ma'am. So this is the UV cure right here. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so I use a special finish called Rad Coat. Uh -huh. And what it does, um, it's, uh, it's the only finish that can be UV cured. And I'm taking this light, you know, just like you go get your nails done. Right. Same, same concept. So all those people here earlier, those were the investors? That was my boss, his boss. Investments team, and then the um, chief uh, investment officer for the company, and yeah, super oh, high level people. Nice. This well, is amazing. And they were happy with the services. Yeah. Thank this you. Looks great. That looks great. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Yeah, this is good. We can, this is gonna save us some money. Yep. <laughs> so. and that's what it's all about. So what I'm gonna do is, uh, like I said, this weekend. Not this weekend, but by the end of this week, I'll just email you a set price. So every time I come out, like you said, five, ten units. Yeah, so like give me a price on like, if it's a, like a color correction, like 2101. That's yep. probably going to be the norm. Yeah. This is going to be a one off. Okay. I think. Yeah. But when you, but if that's the case, then yes. you'll know what the whole scope is. Yes. Like. And every unit also, too, would get the UV cure. Okay. So that way, um, not only are you getting the best finish on these floors, but also quick turnaround time. And it'll be consistent. Because like the one I'm doing after this, you said someone's moving in tomorrow, right? Right. Friday. Yeah, it's tomorrow. Tomorrow's Thursday. No, tomorrow's Thursday, yeah. So I tomorrow's Thursday, I'm sorry, yeah. <laughs> yep. So yeah, but you know, if he was moving in tonight, he could move in tonight. Beautiful. Yep. Love it. Thank you. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get this UV cure. It'll probably take me about 10, 15 minutes. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna shoot downstairs and UV cure that one. And then we'll wrap up before you leave. Awesome. Thank you. guys i am done with the uv on this unit floors came out amazing man amazing i'm so proud of myself so proud of the opportunity again thank you shaw for referring me to one builder and that builder referred me to another builder and that builder referred me here and um that just happened you know guys that's, that's just some of the things that can happen when you treat people right and you got a great reputation um so this, this has definitely been a great experience and like i said man um just to have you know more of these opportunities and be their go-to guy it's a great feeling. So uh, I got this one UV cured. So I'm gonna go show you guys the other one which came out amazing as well. But you know what guys, about the UV cure? Remember that job that I did in Alpharetta like three weeks ago where the UV cure didn't go right because of the humidity? I'm still upset about that job. <laughs> I am, and you know what was funny is one of my colleagues called me last week and he had an issue with a humidity uh, finish that he had to knock back down, but it wasn't the UV, it was just, you know, a regular finish. And uh, so, you know, but what's funny is I never had a humidity issue ever, okay, ever. 
um, until that job. So anyway, um, I, I just totally went off the record. So anyway, guys, let me uh, get this unplugged and I'll just show you guys these floors. They are very, very happy. All right, let me go down to the other unit, get that UV cured and um, all right, guys, I just got to the second unit. I'm about the UV cure. I'm gonna end the video here um, because I, you guys already know uh, how this machine works. But guys, look at these floors. Remember before all that missing color? Oh my goodness, that came out amazing, amazing. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this floor UV cured. Probably take me 15, 20 minutes. And she is, uh, I heard her telling some of the other coworkers that how um, impressed they were. And look, remember here, remember that water damage area? So it's obvious, but it's not obvious. And it definitely looks better than how it looked before. And again, these floors cannot be sanded. They can be replaced, but a lot of times people don't have extra boards and it's hard to get a match because I've seen people try to match these floors with other boards and it, it, it just looks night and day. Uh, so this is a great option, great option. All right, guys, thanks again for watching. See you in the next one. <laughs> it's been a great day today, great day.